Hey YouTube, it's Kesmir, and we're back with a story about my uncle. So let's just jump right back into it. Hmm. Okay. Arrow points this way, so we'll go this way. We'll see what happens. There's a checkpoint. Makes you feel pretty small, this game does. At least this place. <clears throat> Freddy? You here, Freddy? It was dark all around me, but there was a light at the end of the tunnel. Rather dark indeed. Is this Freddy? Did I find Freddy finally? You've been avoiding me so long, Freddy. I'm here to annoy you. Hi! Nephew. Uncle Nephew. Fred. Uncle Fred. I finally found him. My little boy. I'm glad to see you. And you're mm. wearing the suit I made you. But how can you be here? I said that I found the suit in his workshop. And that I came looking for him. I'm sorry for being away for so long. But I've been busy down here, you see. The frog people. That was an experiment of mine. Do you remember the eggs I found before? I sent them here by accident, and I had to follow. By the time I got here, they were already growing. These caves were empty before, but my experiment has made them full of life. I've conducted research on them and documented everything about them. And I built a new crystal-powered pad to be able to get back to my colleagues, show them how fantastic this all is. I interrupted Fred and told him about Maddie. How we came all the way to Star Haven together, and that I had promised to ask him if he would go see her there. Madeline, my little Maddie, I, I should have taken her to see Star Haven long ago. She was always so curious about the strays. Well, I left her. I wanted to protect her, or rather, protect myself from losing her. I've changed my mind. I'm not going home. What does research or praise matter when I can be here with these creatures? They need me. And it's just as well. I don't trust this pad for more than one ride anyway. You need that ride. I didn't want to go home. And I asked if I could stay with him and Maddie instead. I'm sorry, nephew. As much as I enjoy having you here, you must go home. I knew it! Explore the world on your own. Have your own adventures. I reluctantly agreed to go home. I was going to miss my uncle. I will miss you too. But <clears throat> I'm sure you'll do phenomenal on your own. 
And don't worry about me or Maddie. You'll be fine. The pad is yours, boy. When you're ready. Nope, not ready. I'm out of here. I knew you hated me. You hated me from the beginning. Then when you got to this dead end, you're like, I know, I'll build a teleporter, and I'll tell him it's a good idea to go home. He actually hates me. He just wants to stay here with all his tube food. Do you even want all the measurements I collected? Do you even care? You don't even care, do you? What are you measuring? I have so many questions. Don't look at me like that. Don't you look at me like that. Fine. Whatever. Yeah, look at it. No remorse. Just get out of here. Just slams the button down. Get out. I hate you, nephew. Oh, I hate you too, Freddy! What a jerk. <clears throat> well, that was a story about my uncle. It was a fun little adventure. Good to know that Freddy hates me. All that work, and he just wants to send me home. It's almost like I never even should have came. I should have stayed home and played video games. <coughs> uh, I, I think there's a... I think there's like an after mission, too. So, we'll see. Maybe I'll cut these out, and we'll see what happens. <coughs> but, yeah, thanks for watching. I had fun playing this. I hope you guys enjoyed, too. Um, I think I remember a couple of ago, episodes ago, I uh, asked you guys to recommend things for me to play. I'm, I'm still open to that if you have any suggestions. Otherwise, I'll dig something else up here that I enjoy, and maybe I'll run through that with you guys next. But yeah, it was good. I'm, I'm a Miss Mad Maddie. I won't miss Freddy. You know, that guy, he was a loser. That doesn't even like me. Let's see what happens here after the credits. Oh, yes, yes. I'm in the credits too, you guys. I, I, I should be at the top. So, you know, just play this in reverse. The end. Now, good night, sweetie. Wait, Dad. Does that mean Fred is still there? Who knows? That was the last time I saw him. Don't you miss him? I do, sometimes. But I don't worry about him. Because I know that wherever he is, he's on his biggest adventure yet. Oh, what's this? Dear Fred, Today... I step into the lobby of your house for the last time. My daughter asked me to tell her about an adventure, and I came to think of you. Your house looks just like my mother and I left it years ago. After you'd gone, I was sure she was going to throw out all your stuff, but she just cleaned up. We made you a small memorial. Is the teleporter For a while, still here? I came here every day, just like I used to. Sometimes I could even faintly hear your voice calling from the observatory, asking me to get you this tool or that. I never told my mother about that day. I don't think she would have believed me. Can I believe it? After all these years.
Uncle Fred, thanks to you, I have found an even greater adventure. Thank you. Love, your nephew. Aww. How sweet. Well, that looks like that looks like everything. Well, like I said earlier, I had a lot of fun. Like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys on the next adventure. Kesmir out.